Here's some Max Force Media Day footage that I shot July 2nd. At the end there's some footage that the park actually provided with some on-ride footage of me actually riding the ride. Thanks for the park for having me out for Media Day. Here are some stats that the parks provided for the media coverage day. Here at Media Day. This is from the uh, exit queue. Here it goes, getting ready to launch. in about 30 seconds. It's 6.57 in the morning. Here we go, pulling out of the station. We'll hook up to the launch mechanism once the whole train gets out of the station. This is my second ride on it today. The other one was about 15 minutes ago. Soon the train will go forward and back to get the alignment correct. And then the launch mechanism will hook up. Then we'll hear the sound and launch. There's the sound. The rollback brakes just dropped. couple times to actually, you know, get all the elements and where you were actually at.
Well, with the ride opening in two days on July 4th, media day behind us now, I guess this is the final video for Max Force Construction. Thanks for everyone who tuned in every week, and hopefully we'll have something else in the next couple years. So my thoughts on Max Force is it's a great addition to the park, super smooth ride, the launch is great. Um, I actually love the B-roll. It's just so smooth actually going through the uh, actual inversion there. The uh, ride actually seemed a little longer than I thought it would be, maybe because everyone was saying that it was so short. But um, it's definitely a good intense ride and it really never lets up. The launches were pretty strong all day today.